going? Yeah, it's going. I'm going. Are you going? <laughs> We're well, all going. Yeah, it's a frosty morning here on the on the uh, canals. I, ever, I was wiping frost off the inside of the, the windows this morning. Yeah, so. it must have been 30, 31 degrees this morning in Fahrenheit, probably minus one Celsius. Yeah, yeah it's pretty cold to start the day, but we've gotten the boat warmed up. And yeah, the central heating's on, the boiler's on. Yeah, the so. engine's running, charging things up. Had our breakfast. Had our breakfast, fed the geese and the swans. Yeah, we've and, done it all. And now we're getting ready to set off for our last full day of cruising. Yep, we are going to be cruising uh, pa back through past Bradley, past uh, Farnhill Wood or Farnhill Forest, I'm not sure which it is. And we're looking to moor up somewhere maybe just after the last swing bridge before, before Silston. Silston. Yeah, and then we'll be taking the boat back tomorrow morning. That's going to be kind of a sad day. I think we both... Yeah, I don't really know how I feel about that. Come to really enjoy this boat, so anyway. But what yeah, you, let's get going yeah. and uh, I, we want to show you some of that Farnhill Wood area. Oh, that's an passed. amazing Absolutely location. Beautiful, yeah. So. All right, let's set off. Do it. All right. Pitch a lift. Yeah, you need to slow it down a bit though. Ooh. Here we are. Hello. We're underway. Yes, indeed. It, the air out here smells so oh, it's good. Amazing. It's yeah. like a combination of freshly cut grass and frost. Yeah, it's. it's so clear and clean and just beautiful. I love all the sheep and the waterfowl. Here's a bunch of geese. Look at these geese. <laughs> That's incredible. Geese and sheep.
first two swing bridges done and we've just passed the uh, Polish Airmen Memorial swing bridge and we're heading east towards Silsen and uh, we're actually approaching the Farnhill Wood area that we talked about earlier and the sun is still at a low angle it should be pretty stunning in that wood so um, we are about to head into it and yeah when we uh, go past it we're just going to turn the camera toward the wood so we can just yeah. have a beautiful yeah. look at it we I mean, want to soak that all up yeah there's bluebells in there it should have sun's rays coming through the trees it should just be gorgeous yeah this is uh one of those quintessentially huh yeah, now. oh yeah there is quintessentially ancient english wood so um let's take a look Absolutely stunning. Well, that was us through the Farnhill Wood. Yeah, and that was worth going through Tickover. It's just a gorgeous area, beautiful old wood and bluebells and moss and beautiful yeah. sunlight shining through. Absolutely amazing. It's, yeah. uh, it's not every day that you get to see something like that. And, uh, you don't no, want to hurry through it. That's the only sure. wood I can uh, say was as beautiful was in Colorado, some of the aspen forests we've seen. Yeah. Well, it's amazing. You know, it's so shady in there, and then you you kind of burst out into the sunlight, and it feels like a totally different world. Oh yeah.
I think we're probably about three quarters of the way or maybe two thirds of the way towards Silsden now. We're just passing through Kilwick. Yeah, it's a lovely little village. Yeah, it's 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 a cool place. They have a pub here, the White Lion. We were gonna try and hit up while we were on this trip, but I don't I don't think we're gonna do that no, anymore. We got some stuff in the boat we're gonna have tonight to eat instead of hitting the pub, so Yeah, we're gonna try and clear our food out before having to actually move out of the boat tomorrow. Yeah, it's a pretty little village though. <clears throat> so dinner might be uh, honey and uh, honey, <laughs> honey, and, soup and, honey and scones and uh, crunchy nut cornflakes. No, but, uh, <laughs> not more than on the Leeds and Liverpool Lane House Bridge Swing Bridge, Swing Bridge. and uh, that was that was a workout um, that bridge is extremely stiff and if you don't maintain enough impetus going back the way you will not get it close enough to lock it yeah so it just drags the ground it just grinds and drags the ground so Jason had to Kind of quickly moor up and come and help me get that one, get that one locked. So that was that was pretty rough. Oh, we got it. So what do we got left? One more. I think we have one more bridge left, swing bridge left to do. And we're gonna stop. And then we're gonna moor up and maybe uh, scope out the moorings nearer Silsden to make sure that there's something available before we go through that last swing bridge. So. So yeah. So we're doing good. All right. Yeah. The. Uh, Green bridges are almost over. Yeah, and I'm, I'm I'm pretty glad about that. We are moving along. It's very pretty out here. The sun on those hills. And I don't know about anybody else, but this is definitely my favorite kind of swing bridge. It even still has a chain on it. I guess they chained it to that tree to keep it there. I think every swing bridge should go the way of this one. <laughs> bridge 189, lead by example.
being that we're so close to Sills, then we decided to come on up here and have a little walk around the village. Boy, is it busy. I never would have thought these little English villages would have been so busy. Yeah, they're, they're, they're busy. It's amazing. I mean, it just blows me away how many cars are on the road all throughout England compared to, say, Scotland. It's a lot. <laughs> Anyway, we're just going to have a walk around town and then walk back to the boat and uh, relax and enjoy our last night here. There's Selden Boat. We'll be returning our boat there tomorrow. I have never seen a cemetery like this. Pretty old. Oh, these tombstones are just incredible. Look at them. All the way around they go. Yeah, Silton Cemetery, something else. All right, let's get back to the boat. So yeah, this is uh, what we were talking about. It's we're barely two minutes away from the Silton City Center there, and it's total tranquility, peace, quiet. Yep, on the canal. Yeah, lovely. Uh, not in the middle of town. Not, no, it, I guess it's an A road that goes through Silton. I'm not sure if it's an A road or a B road, but yeah, just either way. Total tranquility here on the canals. Can't even hear the traffic anymore. Nope. It's insane. But yeah, as I was uh, telling Karen earlier. It reminds me of uh, the wizarding, wizarding world in Harry Potter, where it's a culture within a culture. That's exactly what it feels yeah, like. Yeah, it's just its own little thing within a whole other thing. Well, yeah, and the two worlds, like the canal world and the, the quote-unquote normal world, seem to be happy to just sort of exist alongside each other, but largely leaving each other alone. Yeah, so. it's really odd, really odd. Oh, well, I'm happier here than I was up there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you start developing nervous twitch, you know, when you walk through town and thundering traffic and double deckers, you know, <laughs> drafting people, upside you. People trying to run over you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, almost back to the boat. Our floaty home for one more night. We are ready to relax for the rest of the yeah, day. Yeah, and... we got to um, clean out the boat, get it all cleaned up, clean ready up, for the next people. Tidy up, yep. And uh, then we'll be heading to Silsden Boat tomorrow north. morning. To the north. The oh, north. Yeah, after we drop it off, we'll be heading way north to Scotland. So, yep, there's, yeah. I guess there's the north, there's further north, even further north, and oh, you actually want to go to Scotland. <laughs> so. Yeah, so we're gonna, we're going to uh, get start getting things cleaned up and have some dinner and just enjoy being here for the rest of the day before we have to turn the boat in tomorrow morning. Yep. All right. Let's relax. That's right. Are we chasing now? <laughs> 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 